Hey guys, my name is Simpsy. How are you all doing? Welcome back to some more Rust co-op survival on Simpsy Plays. If you guys want to see more Rust on Simpsy Plays, I'd really appreciate it if you could hit that like button and leave a comment and subscribe if you're new around here. Leaving a like and a comment is the best way for me to gauge if you want to see more of Rust on the channel. Now, I do apologize that there hasn't been an upload in quite a while. It's not like I haven't been uploading to YouTube. I did mention this in earlier episodes that this channel the uploads will be a little bit inconsistent simply because I am a full-time youtuber on my other two channels I've been uploading a video two videos every single day on those other two channels so it's not like I haven't been making YouTube videos I just have got out of the swing of things in Sims Simpsy plays but welcome back to rust it is wipe day and we are playing the co-op survival there's only got to be a maximum of three people um, in this at all times, my friends and my brothers, but um, yeah, it should be a lot of fun. R what I really want to do for this co-op series is I want to do a raid. I want to have my first big raid. Now, we do have a small resource just base here at the moment before we move along and build our big base, which uh, we already have a scouted a little bit of the area and we, we sort of know around as you saw I got killed by a, a bear before so we're gearing up in our small little just resource base it's gonna be a lot of fun so if you guys are still enjoying rust leave a like and a comment but uh, let's get stuck into the rust co-op survival adventure it's gonna be a lot of fun okay Mining away, getting resources, gathering up. We've got a nice couple of mountains to the left and right of us. Okay, we've got armored doors now. I'm currently level 19. Watch out, dude. I've got the bear pulled it. It's just going around me. I haven't made, I've just, I might actually, because I've just mentioned it then, you won't be able to hear my brothers or friends recording because some of them don't want to have their mics on camera and stuff. So it's just going to be me talking throughout this if I start to sound like I'm talking in the third person. Alrighty guys, the grind is real. We're slowly but surely making our way up before we can start getting our tower base down. Alright, cool. I've just hit level 20 and there's a really nice flat field over the other side from the resource. So we're going to make a tower base this time and just build it up. I think this is the best way to protect our loot, try and make it as high as possible. We can't make the base too big because there's only going to be a maximum of three of us. But there's a lot of flat area here. We'll try and get a mine down, try and put high external walls around. But this is just the basic gist of the... Um the tower, put the TC in the middle, have three exit points as well. But uh, yeah, it's, we're doing well on wipe day. We're slowly but surely putting armored doors around. We're doing well. Couple hours into wipe day now. We're upgrading the uh, stone walls now. Yeah. Haven't had much PvP action just yet. Waiting for a little bit longer for people to get on. There's a guy there. Near resource. Past the trees towards the mountain. He's just a naked butt. He might be just gathering resources though. I can't hit shit on a stick right now. I'm just going to have to charge him with a pick. He's bamboozling me. There we go. Man, it's too early. I haven't got my shot on. There you go. Good job. There's two of us online now at the moment. Couple of neighbors. I think he's... Yeah, he's from up there. There's a cut. There's a, it's a little bit more active than it was before, which is great to see. We can't, I want to get some more neighbors so we can raid them in the future. <laughs> 
Okay, got three armor doors done and ready to go. The base is coming along swimmingly. And I'll show you guys the, uh, the final, uh, eventually. Okay, guys, an airdrop has just come in. Oh, I thought that was someone else that... We put some TCs around to protect the base. We are three stories high. But let's go and try and get this airdrop. It's, like, right near us on the road. We've only killed, like... One or two naked so far, but this hopefully will drag more attention around. Oh, I'm lagging. My friend's in purple. And the other one's in just wooden armor, but we're lagging massively, massively, unfortunately. Oh, look at this. I'm just stuttering and rubber banding all over the place. For fuck's sake. We really need to get this airdrop. Try and hopefully get some guns. Oh, fucking hell. That's not one of my friends. Man, do you see how far we're stuttering? Oh god, naked's coming out from the trees now. <laughs> That's the black guy with the spear. We got him. I don't know if he's got anything wolf. Oh, he's got the airdrop a little bit of a bit of high qual, 50 high qual. I'm lagging so much though. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, brilliant. Oh, for fuck's sake, I'm going to have to fix this lag now. Okay, guys, so this is what the base looks like so far. We're slowly but surely getting the uh, the base up. I want to try and honeycomb it as much as possible, but I think the best thing we can do is just try and keep on building. Um, I'm still lagging a bit, you can t still tell. We've got airlocks on all the, ent all the other sides of the, um, the doors. But to protect our loot, I think it's the best to build it up as high as possible. I'm just lagging a bit because the doors are taking a little bit long. We're going to have jump, uh, ladder jumps as well. That'll protect us even that little bit more. Okay, guys, we've got some loot rooms done just to store the loot. We're probably just going to evenly distribute it along with in our resource base and the big one we still need to move a fair few more of it over right we're slowly but surely making more low grade we've just got some stock standards furnaces inside we do plan to put a mine outside as well and I would also like to have some big furnaces as well we have roughly that's eh, not bad a fair bit of metal ore just getting that high call underway. Alright, cool. So we're about three, four stories high. We're doing very, very well on wipe day. Just the quicker we can get this base up, the better. And then we can start doing some raids and doing some more PvP. We just need to protect ourselves. Alright, couple get a couple more furnaces in here. I want furnaces inside. And out just in case we do get like sieged at some point. Yeah, let me know in the comments what other sort of builds you'd like to see maybe for the next co op survival series. Alrighty, guys, we finally got some weapons up in here. We've got some semi autos. They're okay, not the best. We only got 16 bullets in them, but at least we can defend ourselves. Alright, got a couple more rifles underway. We've got three done now. 27 bullets, we're only level 20. Two crossbows, we've got a furnace done. Alrighty, guys. This is just the bottom floor of the base. Pretty secure. Jesus, you scared me then. Okay, guys. We've got wooden walls. Even though they can get burnt down incredibly easily <laughs> with a flamethrower. But this is what we're, we're sort of going for. Looks alright. Not bad on the first day still. We've got shutters up top so we can shoot people if they come nearby. So we're roughly six, five stories up. We're doing very well. We've got TCs around. Perfect. 
Alrighty guys, me and my brother are out on a run and we found this cave base which looks really really cool so I thought I'd just like share it with you guys. I wonder if we can glitch into this furnace room. That's a really cool design. Just had to do some hardcore parkour on the top of the cave base. I reckon we can't do it though. No. They've glitched it. Okay, guys, we're going to have our first mini raid here. Currently, just with our <laughs> a red and black pants. We've got some satchels. There's a small base up in the snow that's gone up. And we have some spare satchels. So let's have our first mini raid of the series in episode one. We do plan to do a big raid. We're going to try and go for it maybe in the next episode or the episode after. Or maybe a couple more episodes. Alright, so here is just the little base. My brother said that there's um, there's been a bit of activity up here. You ready? Watch out. <laughs> You're going to get picked off if you say they're to the left though, I reckon. Might want to get down from there. So, we've got satchels ready to go. Just people farming up here. That's where the activity was. I would have recorded, but I didn't kill them. That's the first one done. Got med pens. Semi-auto will do alright, but it's not the best gun in the game. I quite like the P2s. Just try and relocate. Alright. A couple more. We'll see what we have inside. Alright. This should be it. Man, that went off pretty early. You go in, I cover. There's two doors, is that? Nah, bugger it. We're not, we don't have enough satchels, dude. Oh, that sucked. Our first mini raid. He's put a ladder. He's still got his TC there, though. We can take that. Maybe block it up. Yeah, it's a shame. We don't, I, I don't know if it's really worth getting any more satchels for it. Alrighty guys, this is the gear at the moment. We've got three coffees, got some semis. We've got bone armor, which is pretty decent, and two flamethrowers just from runs and stuff. We do have the um, the rad town near us. Also like the radiation plant, um, the train tunnel as well. Alright, cool. Hey guys, how you doing? Welcome back. It's been a little bit of time since I've last hopped on, but this is the base thus far. Okay guys, um, I'm on my own at the moment, and I've just he heard explosions. It's like w day one. It's only just like completely finished day one. It's only just been day two in real life of the wipe day. And there's a massive clan raid going on. There was a pretty decent base down the road, but there's a lot of guys here. Holy shit, can you see them? I'll see if I can scavenge, try and grab some stuff. But there's probably about eight or so guys. There's a lot of exp explosions going off. Oh my god. Okay, guys, they've flanked and, and moved around the other side. There was about three, four guys that actually lived in that base, and it looks like the AW clan has just come and fucked them. They did have a mine quite early on. I'm just going to hopefully try and sneak up and try and scavenge some stuff. But it looks like it's like an 8 versus 4 raid. This is very exciting on the first day. We're only level 21. We're still in very early days. Man, there was that is so lucky. That could have been us. If they just went a little bit up the road. But there's a lot of dead bodies here. So they're actually fighting. There's like a 4v8, 4v6. Come on. Come on. Let's so fucking grab something. Oh my god. Oh my god. A oh, bolty. Run. I'm just going to grab the bolty and run. Oh my god. I've got the bolty. <laughs> I've just stolen a bolty from AW. Come on. 
You've got to be joking. It's still a little bit while, uh, while until I'm home and free. Man, if I, if I can get this home, because as you see, we're only just around the corner here. We'll be able to blueprint this puppy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We can't make bolties just yet. And they've just armed us. Yes, boy. <laughs> get in. Alrighty, guys. Check out this bolty. Courtesy of AW. Man, just being a scav just worked then. Right, so the bolty's locked down and is secure. Man, that clan has just powered us. We're us, our co-op small group with bolties. We're going to be able to blueprint that. Man, they must have just got wrecked by those guys inside. It looks like they're trying to double... They've double walled it inside. You can see it's sort of glitching out here. See if we can grab another. Oh my god, I just got another bolty. Oh, <laughs> I did get mowed down by an AW clan member with an AK. But that's hilarious. I've just stolen AW's bolty. Just going into day two. Okay, I, I, I've gone around here with my sleeping bag. Okay, guys. Um, I died and kept going back a couple of times. Man, I'm so happy that I got a bolty out of that. That's ridiculous. But these guys have bolties on day one? Like, what the fuck? See if they've left anything in here now. Like, <gasps> oh, I'm going to take all this shit. So, a, a, a full, full-on clan raid day one... This stuff might not seem like much to, like, the big 60, 50 people clans. Because that's what AW is. It's a huge clan. I do believe it's Korean. There might be some Aussie members. But this stuff is going to help us in our small co-op survival. Man, I did absolutely nothing for that raid. <laughs> awesome stuff. Okay, guys, I have enough to blueprint the Balti, but that's hilarious. We've got a Balti on day one, roughly day two now. A little bit late at night recording, it's just me at the moment. But we're going to be blueprinting our first Balti. Oh, that's hilarious. Man, that, like I said, we, we can just, like, we could even roof camp the fuck out of them if we want. I'm not entirely sure where they are. They must have a pretty big base somewhere. But now, AW has uh, the clan has supplied us with with bolties. All right, we'll go with the 99 and just with the 10 then. Come on, cross our fingers. And... Will we have bolties? Yeah, because we're still a fair few levels off. Yes! We can get bolt action rifles. Now, they will have some... Uh, what's it called? Uh, damage, degradation, I guess. But guys, I have to end the first episode here. Thank you very much for watching. Just to recap it, we had a small satchel raid which didn't really work out too well. We managed to steal a bolty off uh, a clan. So thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my social media links, Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram, all in the description below. Stay tuned for more Rust videos on Simpsy Plays. If you guys want to get yourselves some cheap and reliable games, maybe even Rust, check out my G2A affiliation link in the description below. Stay tuned for episode two. Hopefully we'll be able to have a big raid in the next couple of days. But now we've got Balties. I'm so, so happy about that. We've got so much stuff for free. But thanks, guys, for watching. Goodbye. Here we go. That's a headshot. He's down. Fucking blew a bullet straight through the back of his skull.